An Okano County Zoo is being forced to close its doors indefinitely. Yeah, the Lakewood Zoo is known for keeping exotic wild animals and offering visitors a chance to see them, but the owners are losing their permits. Fox 11's Laura Smith was in Okano County and takes a closer look. The Lakewood Zoo is home to bears, lions, and tigers. But this winter, the attraction isn't just closed for the season, it's shut down indefinitely. Well, I'll make a motion that we, re we re revolt the uh, conditional use permit. Okano County officials agreed Wednesday to take away owner Casey Ludwig's county permit to operate the zoo. They say that's because Ludwig must also have the appropriate state and federal permits. Reports from the U.S. Department of Agriculture presented at the meeting show he does not. Mr. Ludwig has not maintained uh, a DNR permit for captive wild animals or a USDA permit for um, a federal permit or license for uh, exhibiting of these animals at a zoo. Ludwig faces five misdemeanor charges which stem from possession of bears. The DNR said Ludwig needed a permit to exhibit. He has since gotten the permit but has yet to obtain a USDA permit. Ludwig missed the December 1st renewal date. We do not intend to open the zoo until we have a USDA license in, in play. I am, I'm, I'm only asking the board to somehow delay this. A USDA spokesman says Ludwig's application for a new federal license is currently on hold because of his legal troubles with the state. Not only that, federal officials are currently investigating several non-compliance issues here at the zoo. And some of the concerns that are noted in there uh, deal with uh, uh, veterinary care of the animals, um, uh, where it talks about a male lion has multiple open wounds on his face and the attending veter veterinarian has not contacted, has not been contacted. Ludwig said that was ridiculous, noting it was a small scratch and the veterinarian was called immediately. Neighbors raised their own concerns about security at the zoo. One day we drove up and we had one of his animals standing right in our yard staring right at us. Uh -huh. And it looked like it was going to charge us. Ludwig said the animal was a harmless pot-bellied pig. As far as the outcome of the vote, Ludwig says he wasn't surprised. I totally understand what they're what they're wanting to do. Ludwig adds he knows what he needs to do to get back in business. In Okano County, Laura Smith, Fox 11 News.